What's good, Capital Extra? Robert Bruce in the building. You know everything UK, homegrown. And we like to bring you your favourite artists inside as well. And today we've got one of my favourites. We've some guests in the building, the Godfather, South London's very own LD in the building. Wait, wait, live, 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 we're there, we're there. What are you we're saying, there. my bro? I'm there, I'm happy, I'm good, I'm in good spirits. The process is out, we're moving, you know? Exactly. As you said, the process is out. Who do we have to... Let's go to your left My first. left. Jeez, we've got Nickel Dots, the producer here. Like, I told yeah. them about Nickel I think <laughs> up your true chest champion, a little bit, man. True champion, True <laughs> champion, Yeah, um, just turned 21 the other day, producing for three years and now. Um, yeah, do a lot of different genres, drill, trap, rap, R&B, Afro, everything. So I'm a producer. Okay, you're um, a producer. But yeah. Um, and yeah, that's me, really. Sick, yeah. sick, sick. And to your right, LD, who do we have in this chair? Yeah, man, we got Blue Boredom, you know, director. Sick, um, director. Yeah, man, <laughs> yeah. out here, working with different people, North Jean as well, like Little Dots. Yeah, man, we're out here. Been out here two years now, two years deep in the, two game. Years in the game. It's two years, we've got a long way to go. Okay, okay. We're going to talk about the process today, but LD, I wanted to hear from you first. Mm -hmm. What's going on? What have you been up to, bro? Boy, been working on the project. To be honest, I've... If I was one of them scatty artists, I would have released three <laughs> projects already by yeah. now, but I'm, I'm... Yeah, I'm just working on the sound and making it more musical than I usually do, if that makes sense. So, okay. yeah. And then you got a new one coming with NSG as well. I've seen the yeah, clip dropping. That was yeah. serious. Roadblock. Mm. Hey, that one there. <laughs> Lit is lit is lit. Yeah. Is lit. They, they they got me dancing. You get me? No way. I'm, I'm a stiff man, but they got me moving. You get me? So yeah, I'm looking forward to that, man. But talk to me about the process because you was involved in this show. How did it come your way? What is the process? I hear from all of you. Yeah? Um, I just remember my brother messaging me with an idea from Rashid, but because it's Rashid and I proper clip with Rashid from years, I proper mm -hmm. took interest into the idea. Then I thought, yeah, I'm doing it and. I'm not gonna lie, I'm I'm, I'm happy that I did it. Like, okay, oh, yeah. I'm not gonna lie. It's not like I fell in love with music, but I fell in love with the arts of music, like everything behind it. And that's cause I was away for a bit and I was just focusing on myself. And then that time focusing on myself, I've I've just forgot about music. And now I'm back. This show just helped me. It, it just boosted my my ego. I got my pride. <laughs> myself. I'm re I'm realizing what the Godfather means now. Mm. Probably, you know what I mean, and I'm I'm here to take over again, man. That's nice, man. Look at what's from your perspective. What is the process for someone that hasn't seen it, and what was your involvement in the process? Um, the process for me was like seeing the process of start to end in terms of scouting, trying to find the talent, and then putting them together with the artist, and then from there coming up with the ideas for the video and then actually executing the video and all of that is a process and even then it was like a thing of till today I realised once you think it's finished it's still not finished there's mm. still a whole lot more to do and it's like it sort of made me come back to the actual name of a producer like okay. going, it's going from beginning to the end and not rather not just a beat maker so someone who's there to try to get the idea, the concept down from the beginning, mm -hmm. being at the video shoot, then when it comes to trying to put it out on <laughs> platforms, yeah, all of that is producing a song. Okay. It's like making a beat, so yeah. So you was up against three different producers yeah. as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. So talk to... LD, tell me about your Simon Cowman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to lie, that might have been the, the, not even the craziest thing I've done, but it was all the weirdest thing I've done. Like, yeah. I, I'm, obviously, I've judged a lot of things, but not like that, do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, having all the power and that, and... Boy, like, you know you don't want to be mean sometimes. Yeah. Like, <laughs> sometimes you got you, you get me? Sometimes, like, the truth hurts, but the truth is the best thing, yeah. you get me? Yeah. So, yeah, like, it was just weird, but it was a great experience, yes, you get me? Yeah. I got to give people feedback. I got to work with new producers, new videographers, directors, camera people, like... Like, do you know what I mean? There's not even just, like, these two that you yeah. see. There's a whole team, team behind the thing, and it was it was proper, like, getting to work with them as well. I've got new photographers now. I've got, wow. I can holler him any time. Link, I've linked um, yeah. little, little dots into yeah. the process. You get me? So it's a, it's a good thing, man. Blue, you was part of the director's crew, so three of you had treatments to pitch. We had Fumes mm -hmm. help us. We had Gabriella Kingsley help us as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, big them up as well. Yeah. Without yeah. them, I was lost. <laughs> 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 no, their input was definitely valuable. Blue, from your point of view, like, what was it like pitching a treatment to a music to a track that you only got forty eight hours before? Yeah, I feel like that that was like a massive challenge, you know. Um, I feel like at the same time though, it was good because it almost equips you for you know the real life 
Because, you know, even though sometimes, in, like, in real life, you might get, like, a big budget to do, to do like, a video, you are giving it, like, a bit more time to do it. But to be able to know you've done that in 48 hours, it just makes you think, like, rah, like, yeah, what I can actually do mm. if I get more time. Um, but, yeah, I feel like in terms of the pitching side of it, I kind of just looked at it, like, when you used to have to present something to, like, your uni tutors, you know, because okay. I did film at uni, so I've okay. had to kind of, like, go through PowerPoints before about what my idea is, so I kind of just looked at it like that, like, LD's my uni tutor or something. <laughs> like. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, man. As I've got you here, though, let's talk UK music, UK music scene. Yeah. Who are we feeling right now? What do you feel? LD, you first, and then we'll come to you, boys. K Trap Digger, Mental K, PR, Do Road, um, Young Ads, always Young Ads. Um, <laughs> then you've got the OGs like Skepta, and there's there's people that go without saying, do you know what I mean? Yeah, of course. But, then, like, but they're my main people. Oh, yeah, and congrats to my boy Digger, my number one thing. Yeah, 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 love it. With Wass. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, I love it. Mm. Talk to me about South London. Like, what is in the water? How come we got such talent in South? I, do you know what? I think it's because, like, Growing up in South London, like you're just exposed to so much, so your yeah. your imagination can just run wild. Do you know what I mean? Because mm. you're exposed to so much things, you you like even some people don't leave South London, but in okay. that small South London, so much things happen that you can live ten different lives there. Do wow. you know what I mean? Like I lived five different lives in my estate. Like it mm. sounds crazy, but I did it. Like I've I've been the legit guy, I've been the illegal guy, I've been the church guy. I've been. Do you know what I mean? Mm. I've tried every walk, walk way of life, and. That because you can do so much in South, you can imagine and 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 picture and script so much as well. Do you know what okay, I mean? Okay, I'm with you. Blue, who are you feeling music wise in the UK? I've got to say Digger for one, hundred percent Digger. Um, Heady One, K Trap, uh, my boy Nems from Manchester, uh, Chizzy Five Star from Leeds. Yeah, man, I'm saying like, oh, yeah, man. yeah, yeah. Them guys there at the moment, I'd say like. Yeah, my yeah, my people in a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. And look at that's you as well. It could even be producers as well yeah. from a producer no, point got, of like, view. A long list of a ton of everyone. <laughs> so like in terms of like the up and coming, NSJ Mali, Coldis, Zakar, you've got KD, and then in terms of who I'm feeling like yeah, yeah like the Nines, Potter, mm -hmm. Rizzi, um, who else? I gotta mention no limit and producer packs. They're, yeah, no, okay, yeah. you know what? Big Bro, them up as well. 100%. Like, like, I had to go message them the other day. Like, you know when you're watching the show back and you're like, nah, that beat is cold. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, nah, do you know what? I had to message them. Yeah. Like, yo, we need to go in the studio. We're gonna set something up Literally, with dots and yeah, get it in. Even after they'd play their beat and they come outside, I remember Pax was making a beat. I'm thinking, yo, like, no what's, way. I'm thinking, yo, let me touch that. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> That's not as serious. I was like, nah, these men are cold. But then, even then, like, you got Jester, ES, Ghosty, Madara beat Caesar, yeah, like, yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. all the men got yeah, you, yeah, yeah, all of them yeah, yeah. doing their mm, thing. Their Everyone's thing. going hard right now. So, mm. yeah. Those so, what are we saying? Things. What, the powers is in the UK right now? Powers, 100, yeah, 100. There's all 100. unknown artists, like, like, yeah. I'm, like, like my homegrown people, like there's, mm. there's a dope smoke now. He's coming up. Like I want everyone to watch out for dope smoke. R6 is a name that's been out there, but mm. he's coming back. Like he's focusing on music now. ST, like there's gonna be the like, there's a lot of artists coming yeah. up in the UK now, mm. and it's crazy. Nah, he, man, it's so good to mm. love. Right, it keeps me in a job, so I'm happy yeah. as well. Yeah. You know what I mean? Of course, of course, of course. So let's talk about the show some more. Yeah, there were some. Moments that I didn't even realize were funny when we was filming that. When we watched it back, it was hilarious. I think we've got to start with that shoulder tap. When you get that shoulder tap to be like, move on to the next beat, yeah. like, how does that feel, like, the cool yeah. 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 When, I'm, when I was in the moment, I'm thinking, yeah, when I was playing the beat, I'm thinking, okay, how long are they, are they not going to tell me when to stop? So when they gave me the shoulder tap, I was sort of like relieved. Oh, like, okay, now yeah. on the next one. But when you watch it back, it's completely different. Yeah. It's like, oh, yeah. Because they do play the beat for like a good 10 seconds. So it looks yeah. like, oh, yeah, nah. Yeah, next one, next one. Yeah. <laughs> nah, like, it was, I found it funny, though. I found it kind of funny, yeah. Yeah, and Blue, you obviously had the phone call from LD. He said he's going to be there at 2. <laughs> <laughs> so, no, you, in fact, you wow, tell bro. the story. You tell the story. Don't let me tell it. Bro. Yeah, nah, literally, obviously, yeah, decided to call him. Yeah, my man obviously says he's going to be there at 2. So, obviously, these times are like, okay, cool. Like, we're planning around that. Obviously, three hours <laughs> passed. My man still ain't showed up, innit? So, obviously, that's why we had to, like, let go of quite, a, like, a few of the scenes that we had planned in that. But, 
you know, these things happening. I'm yeah, used to so artists yeah, showing yeah, up late. Yeah, it was like, a vibe. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Obviously, say you got to look up the dog in it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That guy phoned me. I was walking my dog. Like, he's a puppy. You know what I mean? Like, he's a, I don't want to be a deadbeat dad, you know? I, I, I had to try, bro. <laughs> Yeah. Nah, but yeah, that's what I'm saying. This kind of stuff happens all the time, innit? And obviously, being a director is about problem solving, innit? Mm. So obviously, things don't always go to plan, but in the end, you know, you got to make sure it works out, innit? What was it like actually writing for this single and then doing the video for it? Do you know, Smad, you was there, Lucas. Yeah. I'm not a man that writes lyrics. Like, I, 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 I don't know how to put pen to paper like potter paper. Like, that, 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 <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how to put pen to paper. I don't like writing lyrics on my phone. What I write and I read, I don't like. So I'm a man that just, it's all in my mind. And if a beat's good, it will, it will bring something up all, to, all the okay. time. You like you saw yeah. when I stopped, I was like, no, no, put the beat back on. I got another line, yeah. I got another line. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I got another line. So yeah. And it, that's it, how it, it came was, together. Yeah. Let's get into it. <laughs> <laughs>